I am back on my webcam. It's my working. I'm Miss Rebel Silence Daily Rambles. Today we're doing season three, episode nine, the mid season finale of Legends of Tomorrow. And it's called Bebo, the God of War. So we go with Young Stein getting a gift and basically uses like an arrow, um, uses the arrow to shoot down the gift to make it so they can get to it. Then he makes a run for it because it's Christmas time and everyone's after Bebo, the blue fuzzy animal. And then he gets transported into a different time with a bunch of Vikings. Then um, Leon, uh, Leonard, Leo Snart, I was gonna call him Leo, wants to help with the puppet to help with grieving with the team. And it does not go well whatsoever. Nick actually punches it repeatedly. <laughs> and um, then they give it an acronym to go to 1000 AD, to, um, which are Vikings and to um, fix it is at a level 12. Then Jax is just upset about everything that's been happening with Stein and everything, so he's still not adjusting well. And then they, um, then Sarah sees Stein um, tied up, so Jax goes to get him, and then they rescue him and get to the ship, and then they realize they see Bebo as a god. And then we have Jax and they talk, and then the team talks, and then um, Mick gets mad at, at Snart, and because he made the alcohol, the um, ship alcohol free, and Mick does not do alcohol free <laughs> at all. And then um, Sarah asks for um, the Burrow's help. They and um, it gets denied, but the girl does help them. I will say that. And I don't know if my mic is all the way over here or not. We're about to find out. <laughs> Anyway, so um, the Team Bureau girl, um, they can't help because they are in disarray and they just cannot. Well, the girl does help them out. And so they disguise themselves and bring booze to the Vikings. Then Mick is in trouble because since he's kind of going through a drought, he's trying to find me and he takes it from Bebo the God. And he gets busted and he gets thrown through a fire, which Leo puts out with his freeze ray. And so they kind of spin it, and um, because the Vikings didn't see that, so they they're trying to say, "Oh, he's meant for something great or something." Then Zari and Jax play games on the ship. Then Stan wants to go home. Then we get to where Mick literally destroys Bebo with his heat ray gun. Then the Vikings were going to go home until Odin slash Dark interrupts and. Um, throws lightning everywhere. <laughs> so then uh, Jax drops off Stein, Stein in 1992, tries to give him a letter to read on November 28th, 2017. Everett says no, but then he does take the letter. Then Mick and Leo fight some more. And then, um, then Sarah talks to the time period girl and she says that Rip is in prison and the time period is in disarray and they're just trying to stay on focus and trying to find a way to combat malice. The Sarah is going after Dark solo, but the, uh, they decide to discuss the plans, actually think through plans, and so they think it through and give different scenarios. And so they do the plan where they all help out. And it doesn't go well until Bebo is reborn. And but it's really um it's really Ray and the um and the bear talking to him and through the um, Viva voice. And then uh, they KO Nora, and so then Sarah got to Dark because Star was trying to take him back, and so she cries onto him right before they take off, and then um, goes into another dimension and found Malice. The Time Bureau girl rescues her, and then everything is fine, and then Jack visits Stein again in 92 and gives Lily the Bebo. Uh, animal thingy and so he um, turns out he burned the letter and that's why he didn't come back or was on the ship and tells him to let him go then Jax and um, Sarah talk when he gets back on the ship and he wants to leave not forever but just for a little bit and um, and so basically um, he says he just doesn't want to tell anyone but what Sarah does he throws, she throws a Christmas party slash goodbye party to Jax, and so they talk about Stun, and then when they uh, drop off Jax, Constantine shows up and needs her help. And that's how we end the episode. 
And this is the last, this is mid season finale, so we'll be back until February of 2018. <laughs> so, um, I this episode was very weird. I'm gonna be straight honest, it was super weird. I was like, what's happening? I'll give this a B plus, but I was just like, what is happening? <laughs> I don't understand what's happening here. But um, I did like the back half a lot better than the first half. I thought the first half was kind of cheesy, but the back half I thoroughly enjoyed. So, And it's really interesting the dynamics between um, Sonar and Mick now, because it's a good Sonar and still kind of bad Mick. So the way they interact is very interesting. So I'm very interested to see where that's going to continue to happen. And I forgot to pause the TV. Anyway, um, I hope you enjoyed this episode. So if you like this video, please go to like, comment down below, and tell me what you think. Do you agree, disagree? And then subscribe stuff or <laughs> comment down below to suggest new things for me to react to. And subscribe, and I'll see y'all next video. I want y'all to have a super awesome day. Bye.